In today's video, we're going to use this high power, high frequency Tesla coil, which generates pure plasma. We're going to use that plasma to do a whole bunch of different types of flame tests. So these are all the element samples that we're going to test in our flame. And we have a whole bunch of things here, including metals, uh, group two elements, group one elements such as uh, lithium and uh, cesium and uh, things like sodium. We're going to even try boron in the form of boric acid. That's supposed to produce an intense green color, which will be interesting. Let's start with cesium in the form of cesium chloride. It has that beautiful sort of purple color. Next, lithium metal. Now let's test the sodium carbonate. Next is calcium. Okay, we're gonna go for strontium next. Okay, we're going to cut a piece of bare metal and test it. Next is potassium in the form of potassium nitrate. And finally, last but not least, is boron. As you probably noticed, the color of lithium versus strontium in a flame test is quite similar. So let's uh, look at them side by side. Lithium apparently is supposed to be more pink than strontium, but I really found it hard to tell. Thanks for stopping by, folks, and I uh, hope you enjoyed this video. Flame testing different types of elements using a high-powered Tesla candle.